baseball here on the show. Today it'll be Diamond Dynasty Baseball between Los Angeles and Fresno. It's going to be a premier pitching matchup. Two of the league's hardest throwers go head to head you know, next. And now here is Brian Reynolds. Brian he will lead this one off Reynolds. today. Ready to deal. Here comes the first pitch. First pitch, one o'clock. The wind up and the 0 1. Our game time temperature here to start play a balmy 86 degrees at first pitch. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Line towards center field. And Reynolds has himself a base hit. So that leadoff base hit means considerable speed aboard to start out the inning. Batting second. Here's Corey Seager as he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty it's strike one right there and it's quickly 0 and 2 now open to send him packing pitch on its way thought about it but he holds up on the knuckle curve one and two. Pitch is popped up. Jones in foul ground. He's got it one away. So one gone in the inning here with a runner at that first. Occurs. And that'll the bring in Mickey Mantle. Mantle. Mickey. Mantle. From the belt. Kicks and deals. Swing and a liner. But this lands foul for the first strike. This is a tough guy to turn two on. It's got to be hit hard. If you're an infielder, you've got to catch it and get rid of it quickly. Betts has a read on it. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Now at the plate, here is Babe Ruth. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. And he tries to hold back on the swing, but I think it would have been ruled a strike anyway. It's nothing in one. Counts even at one and one to Ruth. One and two now as that one's fouled off. In there, a base hit. So now they'll have runners on the corners with two away. Stepping the in now, Cattell Marte, as he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. And they're runners at the corners now. High in the air into shallow left center. Sheffield is there and he puts this one away for the third out so a great job there of working out a potential trouble. So now into the box is Hannes Wagner. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. As he'll take a look at ball one. Can't get around quick enough and that'll move the count to one and one. The offensive game plan today is certainly to see the ball up. This guy is known on the mound for sinker changeup combination. He's going to try and establish down in the zone to get swing and a miss or ground balls consistently. You have to find something above the belt to get loose on. Throw gets him two down. Now to the plate, Mookie Betts. First cuts for him here with the bases open and two away. And right into the shift. He's got it. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. New inning set to get underway. And next to hit is the catcher, Mike Piazza. The catcher, Mike Piazza. First pitch cutter that's by him for strike one. Now a swing and he gets him to pop it up. Thomas is over and he puts it away for the first out. One out base is empty and that'll bring in the third baseman Chipper Jones. Now here's a check swing. Did he go around is the question and yes he did says the man in blue strike one.
hit hard down the right field line. But this will get foul for strike two. Ground ball sent back up the middle. But that finds its way through for a base hit. So that'll bring in Mookie Betts. Grounded back up the middle. Reined in. Throw to Thomas is in time for the out. Next it'll be Corbin Burns. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. Throw down to third. Behind 0-2 now. Hey, I know it's the pitcher at the plate, but he's going to grind it out right here. He's got a chance to help himself, and nothing's a bigger backbreaker to a team than watching the pitcher drive in a run. Jones stands at second with two gone. Swung on in the dirt, strike three, and that yeah. ends the inning. So now it'll be the four hole hitter, Chipper Jones. He's set to lead off the home half of the second. There to take it is Chipper. And a bit of a high throw that time, but no problem over there at first as they record the out. That Next big. to hit, Kyle the Schwarber. Catcher. He's Kyle. ready. Here's the first pitch. Turned on down the line. And he'll step on first for the out. Three unassisted. That'll bring up that Gary Sheffield. No Try to make field. something happen with two Gary. gone in the bottom of the second. Try to check it, and it's 0-1. Bottom of the second here with no score. This one's flared off to the right side, and Mookie will make the play, and that retires the side. Back to the top of the order now, and that'll bring up Brian Reynolds. The Dodgers, the left fielder, Brian Clearly Reynolds. off with his timing on that one, a swinging strike. The offense better get it going right here because they certainly can tell from their dugout this guy is carrying himself with a presence out on the mound. He's got feel for all his pitches. And on 0-2 he misses with a fastball. Man that's a good take there on that 0-2 fastball just missed. He must have a really good eye at the plate. Yanked hard but foul to the right. And another foul ball. Now another one two. Betts looking up. Gone to lead off the inning. Here's Corey Seager. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. But that'll hit off the wall in left center. The center field, that brings up Mickey, Mickey Mantle. Lifted Mantle. the other way down the left field line. Left fielder giving chase. And he makes the catch in the corner. And the runner, not tagging, will retreat to second base. So here is Babe Ruth. He collected a base hit his first time up. From the belt, kicks and deals. Uh, started to go down after it, and he couldn't hold back. It's strike one. And he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. Seeger stands at third with one gun in the inning. Started to go around there. Looked like he held up in time. No. Strike two, says the third base umpire. Here comes the one two. Hey, if you're going to throw a pitch like that to this guy, that's right where you want to miss. Any lower, and he'll probably make you pay for it. Wagner has a play. Two down. So a man at third here with two gone. And that'll bring up the infielder, Cattell Marte. Here's the first pitch to him. Tried to check it, and it's 0-1.
Here's the knuckle curve laid off one and one. Hit hard on the ground towards second. And that'll get by into center field for a base hit. Notch one in the score column as a runner from third crosses the plate. It's a 2 nothing ball game. At the plate, Mike Piazza. He swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. Trying to keep things going now with a runner at first following the RBI single. That's over, but low, it's a ball and a strike. And that one yanked just foul. Here comes the one two. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. Another he's one two going, delivery. Going. Runners going. Popped up. Thomas has room in foul territory. And he makes the catch to retire the. Bottom of the third now. And next to bat will be the first baseman, Frank Thomas. And he'll take a look at a slider here that misses for ball one. One of the things you want to do to get a starting pitcher out of there is make him get his pitch count up, but these guys aren't being very patient. Now the one and one pitch. And a check swing here, but the bat clearly breaks the plane as he's set down for the first out. Now the pitch. Jackie Robinson comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's one and oh. Hey, after those two breaking balls missed, you have to be sitting on a fastball right here. Now a swing, and he pops it foul behind the plate. And he'll put this one away in foul territory for the second out. So the bases are empty. Empty here with two. David Ortiz will pinch hit here with two outs, and the base is empty. As he connects on the first pitch with a fly ball to center. And Mantle makes the catch. The inning is over. Deuce Gossage, a right handed reliever standing 6 3, gets the ball now out of the bullpen. All set for the start of the fourth. And standing in now, one of the best players of the past two decades, the great Chipper Jones. I'm interested to see how focused their ABs will be playing with this lead. I think this needs to be a little bit of a smell blood inning. Keep the fire rolling. I know it's early, but keep the pressure going. Swinging the bat's nice. High and deep to center field. Back goes Betts. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Next to dig in, Mookie Betts grounded out in his last at bat. Yeah, I understand that, Matty, but this guy's got burner wheels down the first baseline. I don't think he even concerns himself with that. He has to put it on the ground. That's part of what makes him successful. A little quick on that swing, and he finds himself behind 0 2. And that is swung on and missed. He's down on strikes. And the first two are retired here to begin inning number four. First pitch on its way. Ah, and he just ramps up and gears the fastball by him. 0 oh 2. Yeah, if he's going to pound the zone with this stuff all game. The offense. But we'll have to press pause as that strike three to retire. Bottom of the inning now. And here's a man whose baseball card goes for more than a million bucks. Hannes Wagner hit in the air down the right field line. Marte is over to his left as he snags this one for the first out of the inning. So one down, no one aboard. And that'll bring up Roberto Clemente. Uh, couldn't hold up on the curveball there as he went around for strike one. Hey, if he's going to execute that curveball, and that's the first one of the day, if he's going to execute it like that, be on the lookout for that one. That's going to be a big pitch for him today. Can't get him to chase. It's one and two. Just hung in there on that one. One out, nobody on. Breaks is bad as this one's popped up. Throw on to first, two gone. 
Here's Mookie Betts. He's 0 for 1 thus far. And now the first pitch. Hey, a two out walk right here would be the time run to the plate, even though it's early on. He's got a guy on deck that has a lot of pop. Burns is there to make the catch, and the side is retired. Now to the plate, here is Brian Reynolds. He'll start off the fifth in this one. Yeah, and going back to that last A.B. when he hit the home run, Matty, that ball was up and out of the zone. This guy's a real good high fastball hitter. So if I'm on the mound right now, I'm thinking I got to get that ball somewhere below the knees because this guy definitely likes that ball up and elevated. Just able to get a piece of that for strike one. Bases are empty, one man out. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Going back is the left fielder to the track, to the wall. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. At the plate now, Mickey Mantle. Mickey. This will go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. No hits to this point. Here's a late swing and a miss, strike two. Woo-wee! That was some smoke right there. High fire right on by. A little late on the fastball, but he's able to spoil that one off, and he'll get another chance. Here comes another 0-2. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. So two out, nobody on. And here comes the babe. Tony oh, leaves the fastball up there. Mistake in location. He is going to pay for it dearly as that ball is sent over the wall. A home run. Now back to the plate now. Cattell Marte. Cattell Marte. Left side, but well foul. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. Late on that one as it's fouled off to the left side. Hit back toward the mound. That's through for a base hit, his second of the ball game. Now back. Standing yep. in now, Mike, Mike. Piazza. Yep. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error. As Set now for the bottom of the fifth, and set to go is the third baseman, Chipper Jones. This is lined to left. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. So the leadoff man reaches in their half of the fifth. Now batting, catcher, Kyle Schwarber. Into the box now, Kyle Schwarber, swinging a ball hit on the ground. Here's the 0 1. Schwarber connects and sends a ball to deep right field. Gone! In now, Gary Sheffield. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Drives it out to deep right center field. Mantle's on the move. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first out. So next to bat will be Frank Thomas looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. There to take it is Chipper. In time to first and there are two away. Next up, Jackie Robinson popped into foul ground his last time up. Yeah, Matty, and I think that pop out was just a result of poor pitch selection. Got to see the pitch over the heart of the plate. He chased well out of the zone, and as a result, didn't really put a good swing on that. One and one the count. Pitch is popped up. Ruth is there, and the side is retired. Top half of the sixth about to get started, and that'll give way to the third baseman, Chipper Jones. The third baseman, Chipper Jones. Fouled off. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. And, and there's ball one. Hard hit ball to second. Fielded cleanly. 
Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. And now in the box, Mookie Betts struck out in his last trip to the plate. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch fouled away. A swinging strike, and now it's 0 and 2. That's just too much velocity upstairs to get good wood on it. It's going to have to lower his sights. And this is swung out and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the sixth inning. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Corbin Burns stands in as he checks his swing here for strike one. Oh, and he looks like a new man out there as this is swung on and missed. It's 0 and 2 now. Now that's popped up. Thomas over to his left, and that will end the inning. Joey Votto is going to come off the bench as he'll be asked to lead off the bottom of inning number six. First delivery to him. He's set. Here's the 0 1. He's got that certainly timed up now. I'd be shocked if the pitcher goes to the well three times in a row with off speed. One ball, Tried strikes, to get him to go after one below the knees, but it's one and two. And he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. He went with the off speed there once he got him to 0-2, but now that they both missed, I think we'll see more of a challenge pitch here. You don't have to give in, but you can't be too cute either. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. So the batting the order bat. turns over now Not and set style. to go. Hannes, Hannes Wagner popped up. Ruth into foul territory. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second Number out. Number 21. Next up, Roberto Clemente. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Tried to check it, and it's 0 and 1. Swing, and he pops him up. Looks to be playable in foul ground. Ruth will put this one away, and the side is retired. Gregory Soto is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Brian Reynolds will be the first one to greet him as he'll have to turn around and bat from the right side of the plate here. Just gets a piece of it. Strike one. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 2. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. And there's a base hit, so maybe some insurance here to lead off the seventh. And he is in the second base with a double, his third hit this afternoon. Next at the plate will be Corey Seager. And he'll try to check his swing here, but he'll have no such luck. It's strike one. So far, two for three in this one. Fastball called for strike two. Don't expect too many more high fastballs in this one. He is known for his sinker, keeping the ball on the ground. Reynolds leads off second with nobody out. And this is swung on and missed. And boy, they took care of a key man there. One away. Yes, he'll get caught chasing a bad one there at strike one. For most people, being down on one would seem like a lot, but this guy is such a good hitter. He doesn't care going deep in the count. He's got runners on base. He has a game plan every time he comes to the plate. Let's see how this one plays out. Ready with another 0-2. He'll try to hold back, but he won't be able to as that's ruled a swing, and there are two away now. Now that the 
first base. He's set and the pitch. Babe, Babe Ruth started to go around, but it's a called strike. 0 and 1. And he falls behind 0 and 2. Popped up. And that's in there. Base hit. They're going to extend their lead as the runner scores from second. It's 5 to 2. The right fielder, number four. At the plate, Patel Marte, as he'll go after a hard sinker that time and falls behind nothing and one. He's two for three and looking for more here. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. The 0-2 home. Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. Now a ball hit in the air to straightaway left. This is carrying well out of here. So now to the plate, Mike Piazza. As he'll swing and miss at a first pitch slider at strike one. He could really use a knock here, 0 for 3 in the game so far. Now this one is blasted to left field, and there's no doubt about it. Back to back jacks. Into the box, Chipper Jones. Chipper. He swings and grounds it to short. Scooped up. Throw in time for the third out, but it certainly took a while as the Ladies inning is fine. At the plate now is Mookie Betts. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. The center fielder. Now here's the first offering. As he'll reach unsuccessfully at a slider away, it's strike one. Looked like that one tied him up a bit, a swing and a miss. His command has been outstanding so far, hitting nearly all of his spots, and that's been a big factor why he's been so successful up to this point. Line drive base hit. And this one bounds around against the wall. And he is into second base with a leadoff double. At the plate the now, Chipper Jones. The first As the first pitch to him is a changeup that can't find the zone. It's ball one. He's one for two in this one. Now a ball ripped into deep center field. Catch made out there in left center as the runner may tag from second. The tag, and they got him at third. It's a double play. Now into the box, Kyle Schwarber. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. No balls and one strike. And a check swing here as he couldn't help himself, and it's ruled strike two. And he'll try and tempt him with one in the dirt, but he'll hold back here. It's one and two. Well, that's a smart miss there. Sometimes guys will chase it down there, especially when they're in protect mode on an 0 and 2 count. A little bouncer. Two out, nobody on. And he goes against the shift there as this is on the ground to the left side. That's through, and he's now two for three in this one. And he'll settle for a single here as they whip it back in quickly. Stepping in now, Gary Sheffield. As he'll take a look at an off-speed pitch here that misses for ball one. 0 for 2 for him to this point. Swinging a ball hit on the ground. Schwarber leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. There's a foul ball off to the right side, and that'll move the count to one and two. And this one's in the dirt. But it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. Ruth has got it, and the side is retired. 